8th class linear equations in one variable exercise 2.5 so question number 8 Aravind has a kiddie bank Aravind and a vekthi ke o kiddie bank undi it is full of 1 rupee and 50 pies coins so a kiddie bank leme munnai 1 rupee coins unnai 50 pies coins unnai so it contains 3 times as many 50 pies coins as 1 rupee coins and 1 rupee coins kante 3 times equal 50 paisa coins unnai indulo kiddie bank lo so the total amount of money in the bank is rupees 35 so 50 paisa coins and 1 rupee coins muttam kalisi in rupees unnai indulo 35 rupees unnai so how many coins of the each kind are there in the bank and 50 paisa coins enn unnai 1 rupee coins enn unnai idi manam ganukovali ikkada condition main ga emichindante 50 paisa coins are there to be 1 rupee coins can be 3 times equal. So, we will do this. Let the number of 1 rupee coins is x. So, 1 rupee coins is first one x. And good day. Number of 50 paisa coins are there to be 3 times of the 1 rupee coins. So, 3 rupees, 3 times of the 1 rupee coins are there to be 1 rupee coins. 3 times are there to be 3 into x. So, 3 into x is 3x. So, this is 50 paisa coins. 50 paisa and 1 rupee kumar chala and 10 yale by 2 yale. And get the 50 and 1 rupee la sagam. So this by 2 and up with rupee 8. So any rupees and 50 paisa coins and 3x by 2 times and 9. Okay, this is the convert of 50 paisa to rupee. Right. So given the total money in the bank is 35 rupees. Matam and the number of 35 rupees and the other one is bank law. So Total on our given 50 paisa coins plus 1 rupee coins is equal to 35. 50 paisa coins and 3x by 2. 1 rupee coins and x and x by 1 and good is equal to 35. So 3x by 2 plus x by 1 is equal to 35. Here the fraction of the cross multiplication. Look at the LCM. 2 into 1, 2 into 1, 1 into 3x, 3x into 1, x into 2, x into 2, x into 2 is equal to 35. 3x into 1 is 3x, x into 2 is 2x, 2 1s are 2, it is 35. So, here 3x plus 2x is 5x, 2 is 2, 35 is 35, 2 you take this side. So, 5x is equal to 35 into 2, 35 2 is a, sorry, 35 into 2. So, 5 is multiplying, you take 5, this one divided. So, 35 into 2 by 5, 5 1s are 5 7s are, 7 2 are 14. So, x is equal to 14, means number of 1 rupee coins is 14. So, number of 50 paisa coins is almost 3 into x. That is 3 into 14 is equal to 42. So, 43 is a 42. So, 42, 50 paisa coins, 14, 1 rupee coins are there in this Aravind kiddie bank. Question number 9. A and B together can finish a piece of work in 12 days. If A alone can finish the same work, in 20 days in how many days b alone can finish it so this is important question very very important here a and b either kalisi oka work in 12 days lo complete chestarata so ade a vachesi okkade aa mottham pani ni 20 days lo complete chestadu aithe b okkade enni rojullalo complete chestadu anedi question ikkada given a and b can do piece of work in 12 days right so then A and B is one day work. Either Kalsi Okoro led the Yesteru and the one by twelfth part. Pandandola led the Yestero and the twelfth part to Okoro the Yesteran matter. So then one by twelfth part and Raskutamana. Given A alone can finish the work in twenty days, then A alone in the one day work is one by twenty. A Oka day twenty days lo complete yesterday work and each other question lo. So, one day lo enta work just do one by twentieth part. Okay. So here B is alone one day work that is equal to A and B is one day work minus A alone one day work. So A and B alone work enta di di one by twelfth part. A alone work enta di one by twentieth part. So in the lo di maam sab that is one by twelve. Minus 1 by 20. 1 by 12 is A and B one day work. 1 by 20 is only A work. So this simplify to get the answer. Here 1220 LCM. Here I am taking rough 1220 LCM. 
two six za, two ten za, okay, two three za, two five za. Now two two za four, four three za, twelve twelve five za, sixty, sixty is the LCM. So twelve twelve means twelve five za, five into one, minus twenty three za, three into one. So twelve five times so and then five into one is now twenty three times what we got three into one five ones are five minus three ones are three by sixty five minus three is two by sixty two ones are two thirty is one by thirty so therefore number of days to take B to complete the whole work. In one day, one by thirty, and a total thirty days. Thirty days la B a work ni okar complete yes sir number. Question number ten. If a train runs at forty kilometer per hour, it reaches its destination late by eleven minutes. So train gan ka forty kilometer per hour. K M P H jende kilometer per hour. Forty kilometer per hour speed to ni gan ka well the. Abi दिन डेस्टन अंत एंड वरक चेरकोवान लवन मिनट्स लेट ये फारटी किटर पर् स्पीड तो बट इफ इट रन एट फिफ्टी किटर पर् अवर अंत दिन स्पीड पुको फिफ्टी किटर स्पीड तो वेते इट ईज लेट बै फाइव मिनट्स फारटी किटर स्पीड तो वेते लवन मिनट्स लेट फिफ्टी किटर स्पीड तो वेते फाइव मिनट्स लेट सो फैंड द डिस्टन टू बी कवर्ड बै द ट्रैन सो अभी एंत डिस्टनस ट्रावेल मन कौन इकड़ी चिना फार्मला रिमैंडको स्पीड इज ईक्वल टू डिस्टन बै टाइम स्पीड इज ईक्वल टू डिस्ट बै टाइम सो वी नीड टाइम टाइम इज ईक्वल टू स्पीड यू टेक् हिर् टाइम यू टेक् हिर् टाइम इज ईक्वल टू डिस्ट बै स्पीड फार्मला मैं गुर्तक इपू लिस्टन टू बी कवर्ड बै द ट्रेन इज ईक्वल टू एक्स किटर्स सो मन का Distance distance covered by the the train train is is x kilometers. Given speed of the train is 40 kmph. First speed of train is 40 kmph. kmph. First So time taken to travel the x kilometer with the speed of 40 kilometer per second is equal to time. Time taken. Time is equal to the formula distance by speed. So distance and the x kilometer. Speed and the 40 kilometer. So x by 40. Okay. Distance by speed and distance x kilometer. स्पीड वे फारट कि सो एक्स बै फारटी सो गिवेन स्पीड आफ् द ट्रेन इज ईक्वल टू फिफ्टी के एम पीहे सैकंड के सो दी टाइम एंत टाइम टेकन टू ट्रावल एक्स कि विथ द स्पीड आफ फिफ्टी किटर इज डिस्ट बै स्पीड डिस्ट एक्स कि स्पीड वे फिफ्टी किटर सो एक्स बै फिफ्टी फस्ट टाइम फस्ट स्पीड को टाइम पड़ती एक्स बै फारटी अवर्स सैकंड स्पीड के एक्स बै फिफ्टी अवर्स So total time, according to the given sum, the difference between the times. In the difference, you first to forty kilometer speed ki eleven minutes late, second to then ki five minutes late. So the difference and then the six minutes. The minutes in manam hours log mars the six by sixty division with sixty minutes. So six ones are six tens are and one by ten hours. Okay, one by ten hours so difference and matter. Then this difference is. x by 40 first speed okay first speed time x by 50 second speed time it don't it difference ent undi manaku 1 by 10 hours so then simplify it here it is lcm is 40 50 lcm is how much see here in the rough 40 50 two table 20 25 Five table four five five is a so this is five 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 two is a ten ten four is a forty forty into fifty two hundred two hundred is the LCM two hundred forty n times what is the number five times so five into x five x fifty n times what is the four times four into x is four x this is equal to one by ten here it is. Zero zero get cancel. Five x minus four x is x by twenty is equal to here it is one. Then x is equal to twenty into one is 
20. So this is the 20 kilometers distance it can be traveled. So here you write the statement the required distance to be traveled by the train is equal to 20 kilometers. This is the answer. Question number 11. One fourth of the herd of deer has gone to the forest. One third of the total number number is grazing in a field and the remaining 15 are drinking water on the bank of the river. Find the total number of the deer. So here let it the number of deer is x. Any deer sunne, x sunne. So given the number of deer has gone to the forest. One fourth has gone to the forest. So one fourth means one by four. One by four into total deer. One by four into x is x by four. So given number of de deer grazing in the field is one third. So grazing is given one third. One third into total number of deer. One by three into x is equal to x by three. So given number of remaining deer is equal to fifteen. Number of remaining is this one. So according to the sum, total deer minus this two okay is equal to remaining so this one you simplify to get the answer here x by 1 here x by 1 minus this one you simplify it first 4 3 is a 12 3 into x 3x plus 4 into x is 4x is equal to 15 then x by 1 minus 3x plus 4x is 7x by it is 12 is equal to 15 now 12 into x 12x minus 7x by 12 into 1 is 12 is equal to 15 then 12x minus 7x is 5x is equal to 12 into 15 then x is equal to 12 into 15 by 5 5 ones are 5 3 is a 12 3 is a 36 so, 36 is the answer. You should write the statement. The total number of deeds is 36. Okay. This is also very very important. Question number 12. By selling a radio for rupees 903, 903 and a shopkeeper gains 5% and uh, find the cost price of the radio. So, you can shopkeeper of radio 903 rupees ki sell yes in the and then again the china profit and take gain at a profit and the chini five percent of chini so then actual cost cost price and then another question here the answer given selling price you write down nine not three selling price so gain and the g is equal to five percent cost price is equal to how much so i'm gonna go farm long the graph cost price is equal to selling price into hundred by hundred plus g so these values you substitute here selling price is how much 903 into 100 by 100 plus gain percentage is 5 so this is equal to 903 into 100 by 100 plus 5 is 105 right so this multiply means zeros only zeros means just you add the zeros 903 two zeros by 105 so this one you take the division here I am doing in the rough 105 So you take the 900 means 8 times you take 8 fives are 40 4 carry 8 0 0 4 8 ones are 8 okay, 8 40 3 minus 0 is 3 10 minus 4 is uh, 6 63 then remaining 2 zeros you keep it then 6 times you take 6 fives are 30 3 carry 6 0 0 3 6 1 the 6 so 6 30 1 0 is remaining 1 0 is right here right so 860 is the answer rupees 860 is the cost price write the statement finally therefore the cost price of the radio is equal to rupees 860 Question number 13. Shaker gives a quarter of his sweets to Renu and then gives 5 sweets to Raji. He has 7 sweets left. So, Shaker the gara sweet packet. A packet lo quarter. 
వాటర్ అంటే ఎంత వన్ ఫోర్త్ వన్ ఫోర్త్ రెయిన్ ఒక ఇచ్చిండు అండ్ ఆ మిగిలిన వాటిలలోకి వెళ్ళి ఫైవ్ స్వీట్స్ రాజీకి ఇచ్చిండు సో రిమైనింగ్ ఆయన దగ్గర ఎన్ని స్వీట్స్ ఉన్నాయంటే సెవెన్ స్వీట్స్ మిగిలిపోయినాయి ఓకే వాటర్ అంటే వన్ ఫోర్త్ వన్ ఫోర్త్ ఏమో రైనుకి ఇచ్చిండు ఫైవ్ స్వీట్స్ వచ్చేసి రాజీకి ఇచ్చిండు సెవెన్ స్వీట్స్ శేఖర్ దగ్గర మిగిలిపోయినాయి సో హౌ మెనీ డిడ్ హీ హ్యావ్ టు స్టార్ట్ విత్ అంటే ఆయన దగ్గర టోటల్ స్వీట్స్ ఎన్ని ఉండేదని క్వశ్చన్ అడుగుతుంది సో ఇక్కడ మనం మొత్తం స్వీట్స్ టో ద నంబర్ ఆఫ్ స్వీట్స్ విత్ ద షేఖర్ ఎక్స్ అనుకుందాం ఎక్స్ అనేవి ఉన్నాయి మనకు తెలియదు కాబట్టి ఎక్స్ అనుకున్నాం గివెన్ నంబర్ ఆఫ్ స్వీట్స్ గి నంబర్ ఆఫ్ స్వీట్స్ గివెన్ టు రేను రేణుకి ఎంత ఇచ్చిండు వన్ వన్ ఫోర్త్ ఆఫ్ ద టోటల్ వన్ ఫోర్ ఇంటూ ఎక్స్ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఎక్స్ బై ఫోర్ గివెన్ నంబర్ ఆఫ్ స్వీట్స్ టు రాజీ రాజీకి ఎన్ని ఇచ్చిండు ఫైవ్ స్వీట్స్ ఇచ్చిండు సో ఆయన దగ్గర ఎన్ని ఉన్నాయి శేఖర్ హ్యాజ్ ద సెవెన్ స్వీట్స్ లెఫ్ట్ సో ఇప్పుడు టోటల్ స్వీట్స్ ఇవి ఇవి టోటల్ స్వీట్స్ మైనస్ వీళ్ళిద్దరికి ఎన్ని ఇచ్చిండు ఎక్స్ బై ఫోర్ ప్లస్ ఫైవ్ ఇచ్చిండు ఇవి తీసేస్తే మిగిలినవన్నీ ఆయన దగ్గర ఉన్నాయి సెవెన్ ఇది ఈక్వేషన్ ఓకే దీన్ని మనం సింప్లిఫై చేసుకోవాలి ఎక్స్ మైనస్ ఎక్స్ ప్లస్ ఫోర్ ఫైవ్ జా ట్వంటీ బై ఫోర్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు సెవెన్ ఎక్స్ మైనస్ ఫోర్ ఇంటూ ఎక్స్ ఇస్ ఫోర్ ఎక్స్ మైనస్ ఎక్స్ మైనస్ ప్లస్ మైనస్ ఇంటూ ప్లస్ మైనస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ట్వంటీ బై ఫోర్ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు సెవెన్ ఫోర్ ఎక్స్ మైనస్ ఎక్స్ ఇస్ త్రీ ఎక్స్ మైనస్ ట్వంటీ is equal to 4 you multiplied here 4 into 7 so 3x is equal to minus 20 you take right side plus 20 4 7s are 28 minus minus you take this side plus 20 then 3 is multiplying here you take this side it is divided x is equal to 28 plus 20 is 48 by it is 3 so 3 1s are 3 1s are 3 6 are so then x is equal to 60. So therefore, the number of sweets with the shaker at the beginning is 16. And again, any sweets in a 16 sweets in a 16 sweet look only one fourth emo Reno kitchen do five sweets emo Raji kitchen do seven sweets and again. So this is the end of the chapter. Next chapter. Next new video with the next new chapter. We can join it. Okay. Thank you.